Have I told you this before? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That if you buy a larger, yeah. That if you buy a larger bed, Mm -hmm. you have more bedroom, but less bedroom. Hey, we'll go back to our stupid racks of Corbin. Oh, Rick. Why did you take that one and not the cheddar? Because I had it in my mouth? Yeah. Mm. Uh, anything? Why? That shouldn't stop you. You lick my butt. I think you should work on saying less weird things. I think you should work on thinking better. True. <laughs> Read this. Where? What? What is it? This is a very lovely live performance of SPB, singing one of the most iconic and treasured compositions of Rajasa. Still can't believe they're making Rajas or uh, composes on this. <laughs> I or maybe, know. maybe making him. Maybe he was like, no, I. If this is about me, I'm gonna get the music. Well, directors right. direct their own biopics, when? so Spielberg just did it. He just directed his own. That's his own story. A little self jerk off, if I'm telling you. Hey, no, <laughs> not at all. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> SPB, he can't sing very well. I didn't say that. You did. I also didn't mean it. Bring that smoothest silk voice in. Hey, oh, mm, la, la, la. Uh, he's like a little pillow to sleep on, isn't he? He is, he's like the clouds. People in the crowd. <laughs> Just that guy. He's probably like an MP or something like that. Yeah. Know. Laying on a puffy cloud while you float down a river.
மரம் நாளும் எனக்கு அது சேதி தரும் வானம் எனக்கு ஒரு போதி மரம் நாளும் எனக்கு அது சேதி தரும் இது ஒரு போர் மாலை பொழுது இன்னொரு சரணம் எழுதிருக்காரம் சரணம் இரவும் பகலும் யோசிக்கிறேன் என ஏதினமும் பூசிக்கிறேன் சாலை மனிதரை வாசிக்கிறேன் தீன் சிவப்பை நேசிக்கிறேன் வேதங்களே வேதங்களா கூடாது இது ஒரு Sing me to sleep, Daddy. <laughs> Such a soothing voice. SPB Daddy. What day do you want to sing or sing? What day do you want to sing? It's not self-respect. It's not self-respect. It's a lot of pain. It's not self-respect. 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 He's just letting everybody know, in case okay. they don't know, he's, he's that just, if, if you've never watched OSR, don't. <laughs> Those Bollywood Ben Chots. <laughs> They're single-handedly ruining this Indian music industry. Uh, Man, his voice is just so peaceful. I, I'm actually thinking about changing the channel's name to Bollywood Ben Chots. Nice. <laughs> like that. That'd be great to explain to people when they ask. The Bollywood Ben Chotes. Like last night, because a couple people asked us last night about the, the channel. and Oh, that was nice when, when Sorbita said, oh, yeah, I've seen you guys on YouTube. Yeah, you have. Yeah. But to say, what's your channel name? <laughs> Bollywood Ben Chotes. <laughs> <laughs> I love it, actually. I love it. We are now the Bollywood Ben Chotes. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. Uh, you know, yeah, man, his voice is... That's such a great voice. So soothing. One of the most iconic voices. Yeah. Um, I was, I was talking about this with Steph the other day, not, not in terms of singers, but I was like, who's the most iconic voice ever? Oh, that's tough. And it would depend on where you're from. Yeah, but... You mean uh, here in the U.S.? Yeah. So, <sighs> immediate ones that come to mind. James Earl Jones. Morgan Freeman. Uh, the Foo Fighters. Yeah, uh, what's his face? Uh, walking, walking. Uh, Tim Curry has an iconic voice. Al Jeff Goldblum. Yeah. Alan Rickman. Yeah. Another one. Um, Jack Nicholson. <laughs> Gilbert Godfrey. Gilbert Godfrey. <laughs> these people that just have these iconic voices, and so I was like, okay, who would it be in Indian cinema? Not that, because like obviously Shah Rukh Khan's voice is iconic because he's Shah Rukh Khan, and so no, but his voice it, isn't doesn't have the iconic. Iconic like, nature of, a, say, a like a Big B. Yeah, Big B would be the first one. For sure. Amresh. Amresh Puri. Yeah. Gumbo. Yeah. Ushua. Ushua. Uh, but then I was trying to think of the other ones that would... Um, well, I'm sure... I mean, some of... In the South, immediate names would pop up are going to be Rajnikanth and Kamal. But is it because... Kamal is a pretty iconic voice. Yeah, his voice is pretty iconic. Pretty iconic. Um... Because obviously, like, it's so tough to explain because Shah Rukh Khan, if he goes, <laughs> or, yeah, or like he does certain things, those are iconic, obviously. But I'm talking just the voice. Like, you No, hear, like you hear the voice and you know instantly. It's that way with the ones you had just mentioned. When you hear that voice, you know who it is the it's, moment you hear it. It's probably Big B. Yeah. Um, Amresh as well is, is very iconic. Nasir's got a pretty 
Yeah, he does. Standout voice. It's 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 basically it's you have to have something unique about your voice that's like oh that is so yeah the pronunciation I, I mean, the I've never heard anybody talk like you do right um or it's like Stallone's really, got a pretty so does Schwartz I mean Schwarzenegger yeah, come on that's an iconic voice yeah um it just has to be so like either like really, James Earl Jones and and um, uh, Morgan Freeman really deep uh, yeah. how they talk or. Tim Curry has a really unique way of talking as well. Johnny's and, voice is pretty iconic. Johnny Depp? Yeah, because his regular speaking voice is not too far removed from Captain Jack. Yeah, that's it's Captain Jack because his speaking voice is he's a terrible speaker. Uh, <laughs> he's absolutely terrible. Uh, 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 t t Tim, um, yeah. that's about right. Uh, <laughs> He's awful at speaking. No, 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 He's very no, no. shy, uh, very reserved. When we were doing the show. <laughs> yes. Jeff yeah, Goldblum yeah, yeah. is definitely up there, though. If, yes. Uh, uh, <laughs> and, uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> well, then, and then. He goes, uh, He's so unique. He is. So I was just trying to think of an Indian. Uh, not, not Downey's, Robert Downey Jr., when you hear him, he's pretty recognizable. Yeah, 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 now he's pretty recognizable. Yeah. I was just trying to think an Indian, so you guys have to let us know. Um, yeah, who for you guys are the voices that you hear him, and it's an instant... Yeah, I know that voice. Because mm. I feel like a lot of people just say their favorite actor just because they love him. But it has to be more than just... Like Bradley Cooper is a lot of people's favorite actors here, but his voice wouldn't be as immediately recognizable as Christopher Walken. Gary Oldman, magnificent actor, would not be as easily recognizable as Arnold Schwarzenegger. See, all the ones that are coming up are like Lara and Mohammed. That's not what I'm talking about. Uh, no, uh, no, no. We're talking just a unique template of the voice that you hear it and you know who that is instantly Let's see. oh god still Muhammad Rafi you're just listing singers that's not what I'm talking about okay here we go I'm gonna talk about Chai. Rithik has got a pretty interesting Kabir Bedi I don't know him Rizzi um yeah, somebody they did list Shower Khan Shower Khan's probably in the top 10 just because of who he is mm -hmm. you know um, no, I'm not. People aren't understanding the question. Amir Khan. Um, I think Anyarag has a very interesting and recognizable speaking voice. Amir would probably be in the top ten. I don't think in the top five. He has a pretty recognizable. Very, yeah, it's pretty recognizable. We've speaking. done games like this. You guys, some stupid babies, have sent us voice recognition games <laughs> that we have failed miserably Irfan has an iconic voice though yes he, he does has such a unique way of speaking yes he does um, and i think a lot of indians would instantly recognize the the speaking voices of rani Mukherjee, kajol and taboo yeah. i think they those would be some pretty iconic you know for me i don't know why it is but reka yeah i i recognize reka the minute i hear her talk yeah anyways well you guys let us know who do you who do you think the most not singing voice just most iconic voice uh, in Indian cinema. List them off uh, down in the comments below. Just